Good morning students. This is Amit sir on this side here. Today we are going to take a small revision test for your upcoming PT2 examination regarding your chapter 10th, 11th and 12th. In this revision test we are going to revise and practice assertion and reason type questions. For those students who are unaware of it, I want to explain that assertion means a statement and reason means an explanation about that particular statement. In this type of question, we generally have four options here and you have to choose one of them. So, our first question will be question number one. Assertion. Adolescents should be careful about what they eat. Reason. Proper diet is needed for the rapid growth taking place in their body. Option A is if both assertion and reason are true and the reason is the correct explanation of the assertion. Option B. If both assertion and reason are true but the reason is not the correct explanation of the assertion. Option C is if the assertion is true but the reason is false. Option D is the if assertion is false but reason is also false here. And among all these four options you have to choose one of the correct option. Okay students. Now our question 2 is Question number two, assertion. Drugs are good for human body. Reason, drugs do not harm the body and it strengthens our immune system. For this, option A is if both assertion and reason are true and the reason is the correct explanation of the assertion. Option B if both assertion and reason are true but the reason is not the correct explanation of the assertion. Option C. If the assertion is true but the reason is false. Option D. If assertion is false but the reason is also false. Now our question number 3 is Assertion. Two boys A and B are applying force on a block and the block moves towards the boy A. The reason is magnitude of force applied by A is greater than that of B. For this option A is if both assertion and reason are true and the reason is the correct explanation of the assertion. Option B, if both assertion and reason are true, but the reason is not the correct explanation of the assertion. Option C, if the assertion is true, but the reason is false. Option D, if assertion is false, but the reason is false. Now we have question number 4. Assertion. When two forces act in the opposite direction on an object, a reason, the net force acting on it is the difference between the two forces. For this, options are option A, if both assertion and reason are true and the reason is the correct explanation of the assertion. Option B, if both assertion and reason are true but the reason is not the correct explanation of the assertion. Option C. If the assertion is true but the reason is false. If assertion is false, this is our option D. If assertion is false but the reason is false. Now our question number 5 will be assertion the force of friction comes into play 
whenever the surface in contact tend to move or move with respect to each other reason if one of the two object is liquid for this options are option a if both assertion and reason are true and the reason is the correct explanation of the assertion option b if both assertion and reason are true but the reason is not the correct explanation of the assertion option c if the assertion is true but the reason is false option d if assertion is false but the reason is also false and finally our last question for this revision test is question number six so the question number six is following as assertion it is very easy to work on a oily flow reason force of friction is high on a oily flow option a if both assertion and reason are true and the reason is the correct explanation of the assertion option b if both assertion and reason are true but the reason is not the correct explanation of the assertion option c if the assertion is true but the reason is false option d if assertion is false but the reason is also false here so students you have to choose any one option among all the options provided here and this was our last question for our today's revision test mm. that will be all thank you